Good evening, YouTube. It's me, Loretta, your favorite retail therapist. I do not own rights to this music. Um, this is from the Bridgerton soundtrack. And um, I just wanted to come back and share with you um, my uh, Easter buffet. And I talked about it and I showed you my chafing dishes that I was making, but I also made um, food cover trays as well. And so I just wanted to come very, back very quickly and share that with you. My head is cut off. Um, so again, here are the bowls from my last video and you will see um, that I have finished them off. My diamond toppers did come and there they are. And I added diamond toppers to it and made these uh, covers. These are all from the Dollar Tree. This was the silver one that I was telling you about. And again, adding the Dollar Tree, um, the diamond to the Dollar Tree bowl. And I think they came out lovely. I added this um, charger. These are the chargers I was telling you that cost a dollar at the Dollar Tree as well. So I added these, this charger in the middle of this because this bowl fits so flush that it kept falling off. But that would only um, serve to, you know, to, to secure the food better. Or I could put two items here, right? I could put rolls here, and then I can actually put extra down in the bottom. So it's really um, still, you just make do with what, you're, what you've been given. Um, I'm also preparing myself to have a tea party. And that's why these came into mind. Because I wanted to do something socially distancing. And I wanted the food to be already on the trays, but also covered. So that people would not be talking over the food. And so this is where this came to mind. And so I'm preparing um, a tea. And these will be great at a tea. And with the food, the sandwich is already prepared. And I think my table looks so lovely. I wanted to show you. I made these rose, um, rose shaped dinner napkins. And they're so easy to make. And I wanted to just show you how I make them really, really quick. If you want to do something to impress your neighbors or your, whoever's eating at your house. You just want to take it and you just want to fold it into itself and just roll it. Don't overthink it, just roll it. And then you're just going to take it into itself and you're going to roll it into a rose. And voila, you have a rose. And I just set it in the top of my water glass, my juice glass, and it's a perfect rose every time. And so my table here, I don't have um, hard chargers. I have this soft charger all from the Dollar Tree. Everything that you're seeing here, it came from the Dollar Tree, except for my white plates. These are my very old white plates and they're part of a China set. So that's the only thing that didn't come from my, um, the Dollar Tree, but I've had them for a long time, right? Um, Dollar Tree plate. I was actually looking for more of these, um, but I couldn't find them. Oh, and these didn't come from, the, these came from the Goodwill. Almost a Dollar Tree. Um, and I think I got them for like maybe a dollar fifty each. That's in a previous video. I don't remember that. It was so long ago. And these were actually a gift. These came from the Christmas tree store. Um, my sister got them for me for Christmas. And that was a lovely gift because she knows I like setting my table. And um, again, covering the food once the food is already set. This is again for pre a preset dinner. Spoon um, to the right. Start on your left, fork, knife, and then of course, um, your bread dish and your glass. And actually just have them just for space sake. I kind of have them sitting on each other. But yeah, that's my table setting. I am absolutely in love with this. This has really blown me away. And I mean, if you think about it, if you decide to turn, turn it upside down, just to, you can add a light in here. Imagine this as a fountain, just with light as a centerpiece. You know, it's yours. You don't get, no one has to tell you what to do with your items. It's your item, right? You made it. And I was going to go get some of those Dollar Tree lights or glow stick. You can put these on tables and these will be beautiful lamp centerpieces. Again, again, being creative, you know, create your space. Don't let anyone define your space. Only you can do that. You decide what's beautiful for you. 
Um, I'm looking at my walls. They need they need pictures on them. And um, I don't have a tablecloth on this table right now because we ate here Easter. And the food was really, really good. Macaroni and cheese, cabbage and collard greens, a, a um, beef shoulder, a duck, suckling duck, um, and punch and, and dessert, sweet potato pie, you know, so the tablecloth didn't survive. <laughs> but we were able to wash the dishes and was able to put them back on the table so that I could do this video. I just wanted to show you what you can do um, if you just, you know, decide that you want to create a space you want to make your space welcoming. Um, these chair covers, these chairs are so old, Shay. I can't even tell you. You probably helped me drag these. Um, these chairs are from East 35th Street and they look brand new with this slip cover on them. Just a slip cover. I mean, the, the, my kids have done damage to these, these chairs and you wouldn't even believe it because they are, they're well made, so they're sturdy. But it was that, uh, we call that, piece together leather. So over time, they just peeled. They just, they just peeled. I mean, um, wear and tear. Um, but I really wasn't ready to purchase dining room furniture yet. So I'm like, you know what? I'll just put these chair covers on them until I'm ready and I see what I want. And then that, that's when I will buy uh, myself a dining room set, right? And so yes, create your space. Um, the sky is the limit. Again, this is your dining room. This is your home. There are no two homes the same. And I'm so glad that you were able to join Shay. I see you there. Um, yeah, the fountain. I'm actually, I was actually at a, a, a wedding and they needed some centerpieces. And I was like, oh man, I wish I had known because I know this right here, um, this on itself. Look at this. Imagine this sitting together with a light in it. Right? on a stand, easy, very easily, also can be a, um, a nice centerpiece. And we're talking about a glow stick, a pack of big glow sticks. You don't have to make this, don't overcomplicate it. And you can have a beautiful, beautiful centerpiece. And I just wanted to make this video before I went to sleep. I said, I was gonna commit because I have so many things I wanna show you. Uh, I have a couple more videos already in queue. Um, that I, I already pre-recorded. So I'm gonna try with that method to see if I can do a live here. When I can't do one, do, do one that's already been pre-shot um, pre so that I can show you some of the things that's on my mind and how my mind tinkers and how my mind thinks. And when you free your time up and free your space up, you'll be, ama you'll be amazed at what you can create. You know, I was really looking at this as just being, um, a centerpiece and now I have a whole new layout. I'm having, I guess I'm having a tea party and out of that came this. And, you know, I have these nice four panel trays. I'll come back and show you that again, where the food will be separated on a tray and covered and each lady will have their own um, uh, food um, um, quartered off. No one's handling their food. No one's talking over their food. So it's the perfect thing that you would need if you're hosting a, an event during the time of being socially distanced and you don't want everybody handling the food. I went to a beautiful tea and that was one of the concerns that I had that everybody was walking up to the buffet. To me, that defeated the purpose. I didn't see anybody washing their hands. And I was concerned about buffets before COVID. You know, so to see people go up to a buffet self-serving um, during COVID was very alarming to me. So I'm like, okay, what would I do? If I was doing a tea, what would I do? How would I want that to look? Um, and so I had a wonderful, um, on Resurrection Sunday, our parents was here um, with Paige and we got the grandbabies on the phone and it was just a beautiful, beautiful day. And we were able to sit the grandparents on this side of the dining room. We sat on this side of the dining room and we put Paige in the middle and we were all um, um, vaccinated. So that helped, um, but we still make sure, we have to make sure we're still being wise. Just because you're vaccinated don't mean all the gloves come off, right? And so we wanna be wise in this season so that we can just keep coming out and being out. So thank you guys for um, watching. Um, um, leave your comments. If you want to see more videos like this, leave me some comments. You know, tell me what you're thinking of. Maybe I can help you think of something. I would love to sit and brainstorm or go to the Dollar Tree and see what I can come up with to help you with your event. All right, you have a good night and you be blessed. <laughs>